Jersey. So they were in Vancouver, and uh, he had a sign. He didn't get violent. He didn't even raise his voice. He didn't even wince. And people were in his face, these trans, this transgender crowd, doing this. So you. So you. So you. Quite a discussion, isn't it? Yeah, so the guy is there, someone's interviewing him, and he's just calmly talking to them, and people come up in his face, and they're screaming F you. They're, when I say they're probably inches away from his face, he's probably getting spit on by how close they are, and he doesn't make a move, he doesn't react. But then... One of the transgender activists just punches him in the throat. Yep. Takes him down to the ground. Cops standing right behind him. You ready for this? You ready for this? The police sided with the transgender assaulter. Here we go. Excuse me, did you just say he came here to incite violence by forcing his opinion on people? Yes. You think he came here to incite violence because they got offended by his sign? Yes. When you what talk is to wrong with you? and scream at someone? And he didn't scream face? at all. Yes, he did. didn't. They put their face in his face. What is wrong with okay. you? Okay. So are you saying the guy who How on earth did you become a police officer? <laughs> Absolutely. Bang, right there. That, that was well perfect. Perfect, perfect. How did you? How on earth did you become a police officer? And then it goes on with the police? She is literally what? sitting here saying that Billboard Chris is inciting violence by standing there with his sign. Is that really your position? Okay, sir. We're done with this conversation. Yeah, I thought so. Of course you do, because you're too stupid to fight back if you have a, a, a really valid opinion. Unbelievable.